I'm here because I am concerned about the contracts and the safety for our patients. I think if we're overworked and overtired, we're not going to be able to look after our patients properly and we're going to be uh, more likely to make mistakes because we're only human. I think that since the very start of this process, we've been open to negotiations with the government and they have continued to push their political agenda. It seems to be they're very focused on seven day services rather than providing a contract which is uh, going to actually better care in the NHS. I'm here to support the junior doctor. Um, we all need a doctor. By now the time, the junior doctor needs us. When I was at medical school and uh, trained to be a doctor, I don't think I ever thought that I'd walk out of my employment, but I feel we've been left with no choice. We've gone down all the normal, um, sensible routes of negotiation, and this is all we're left with, I'm afraid. The NHS is not safe in Jeremy Hunt's hands. We knew this day would come. Unfortunately, the country didn't, and we have to fight to these young people have the best possible futures so that they can care for us. We're here to support the junior doctors pickets because we know how important the NHS is for all of us. So there's a whole load of us from Momentum Thanet, from the Labour Party, junior doctors, unite, come here all together to show the junior doctors that we support them in their struggle. I'm here because I'm uh, an NHS consultant, uh, just about, but mainly retired, and uh, we've got to stick together because we all agree that uh, without the junior doctors, we'd be in, uh, we'd be in dire straits. Honestly, I just hope that the NHS uh, can withstand this. I'm concerned that they're gonna, the government's going to privatise. I think that's where we're heading. If this contract continues, if everything happens the way it is, then that's what I'm concerned about. I'm one of the first generation who's benefited from a national health service. My parents did when they were growing up, when they were ill. They had to, they had to pay to see the doctor, or you didn't see the doctor, and you just put up with things. Uh, my mother lost her mother um, shortly after giving birth because they, were, they couldn't afford treatment. My mother lost a baby sister who had diphtheria because they couldn't afford treatment. And we've got to really fight to keep this NHS, keep it national. This isn't about, this isn't really about, this isn't about money, this isn't about anything else other than your safety. And we're doing this for you guys in the long run. It's going gonna, it's gonna to affect you guys, not us.